Okay, no worries. <sighs> Did you finish the stuff you wanted to get done for work? <laughs> That's good. <clears throat> Come here. No, seriously. Take off your stuff and come here. I want to cuddle. <laughs> come here, seriously. <laughs> Hi, baby. Mm. Mm. I've missed you all day. No, I really did. Mm, I know you've been here for some time now but i still missed you you were so busy with work you were just sitting in front of your laptop and just you know working but i figured it would be best if i just you know left you alone because i mean if i would have distracted you 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 wouldn't have finished it and then and then you would have had to work tomorrow again but that's trash i want you to myself tomorrow no oh, you still got stuff to do really babe tomorrow is weekend no no work on weekends your boss is shit. No, I don't care what he said. Will it take long? No? Well, that's good. Then at least I got you to myself half of the day. That's, that's a plus too. Every little minute I get to spend with you is worth it. Mmm. Oh, oh yeah, on Sunday, we go laser tagging with our friends. Um, how are we going to get there? I mean, we're like, how many persons are we? Wait, let me count, I got... I got six people and you got five. Mm. I don't know. Like if we, with us that makes like 13 people, if I count it correctly. I'm bad at math, you know. <laughs> uh, so we need three cars. At least. Well, I suppose Philly could drive. Though I'm sometimes a little scared of driving with him, you know. But whatever, he's not that bad of a driver. Up till now, we never had an accident, which is, which is good. Well, I suppose he could drive. Um, you could drive. <laughs> yes, I'm definitely gonna drive with you. What kind of question is that? Yes, I know Philly is my straight best friend, but um, you're my girlfriend. Mm. <laughs> I love you. Mwah. Well, uh,. So you were going to drive, Philly could drive, and one of your friends, yeah, yeah, they could drive. Great, then everybody gets there. <sighs> Not really looking forward to it. 
Like, it's not often that we get to spend time with all of our friends. Yes, I know. I haven't seen some of them in quite a while. Yeah, for example, Gina. Like, I know what she's doing. Like, we're talking on the phone and stuff, but I haven't seen her, like, really seen her in quite a while. So, I'm really glad I got to see her again. Yes, it's going to be fun. Have you thought about how we're going to make the teams? No, oh, you're right. We have time to discuss that when we get there. But you know, I like planning. <laughs> mm, whatever. Yeah. I'm very much looking forward to it. Not tired. <laughs> Maybe a little. <laughs> What about you? But you must be exhausted after your long day. Mm, yeah, I thought so. Mm, you're fine with being Little Spoon though, right? Yeah, I know. I know you love being Little Spoon. Mm. And I love being Big Spoon because I get to hold you as close as I can. <laughs> Mine. Mwah. Sorry, I <laughs> just had to kiss you. Almost. <laughs> mm. Almost. Well, we can't have that. You have to fall asleep fast because today was exhausting and you say tomorrow you got some work left to do. So you really need to sleep. Mm, yes, I can play with your hair if you want to. What? You want me to tell you something so you can fall asleep? <laughs> Am I so boring to listen to? Nah, <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. No, 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 rest your head on my chest. Um, I gotta think about something. <laughs> Oh, you know what we should do? We should cook together. Like, really? We haven't done that in such a long time. Yes, we always order takeout. Or, you know, just go to a fancy restaurant. Or one of us is just cooking. We never get to cook together. I know we're distracting each other. And last time, I know, I know, I know. Last time the stuff burned in the oven while we were fucking on the counters, but whatever. No, I don't have an idea on what to cook yet. Or maybe we could just bake, you know, muffins or cake or cookies, I don't know. Oh, 
I know cookies are Christmas stuff, but I'm, I think it's, there's something about, you know, making Christmas cookies in, in summer. <laughs> Maybe I'm just weird. Oh, you know damn well that I'm listening to Last Christmas all year long, but when it's Christmas, <laughs> I'm hella annoyed. Well, it's not only last Christmas, it's basically every Christmas song. Yeah, listening to Christmas music all year really doesn't make me love Christmas more. It's like I'm in a Christmassy mood all year long, and when it's finally Christmas, I'm like, oh yeah, no. Uh, it's not that I don't like Christmas. You know, I think Christmas is great it's fun and i guess it has some kind of deep message behind it like you know buying each other expensive stuff <laughs> no seriously i like it because you know that's when the family gets together and i get to see everyone again and your family meets my family it is a mess most of the time, but it's a good mess, you know. I like Christmas. It's, I like this kind of... I don't know. I don't know what to put it, but... I like the way you get to, you know, meet everyone again. Just exchange presents, tell each other how you, how the year was. Yeah. Why? Well, personally, it's not only Christmas. I like winter a lot, you know. Because it's getting cold outside, and you get to wear hoodies, and I get to wear your hoodies. <laughs> I know, I know, you don't like it when I steal your hoodies. I only steal them after you wore them, though. Because then they smell like you. <laughs> yes, there's a reason to me being a hoodie thief. Mm. It's only your hoodies, though. I'm not stealing anybody else's hoodies. <laughs> well, you know, winter is hoodie time, and... I like <laughs> I like wearing hoodies, as you probably know. And you know when it's cold outside, and you come home from from outside, and it's just so cozy and warm, and you maybe you know light a fire in the fireplace. And you're just sitting in front of it, maybe with a hot chocolate. Just, you know, cuddled into a blanket. <laughs> I love it. No, no, I love cuddling with you all year, but no, on Christmas it's especially cozy. <laughs> Ooh, and when you get to wear these fluffy socks, like these big socks, I love that. For some reason, I'm a sucker for these socks. <laughs> I'm weird, okay? Let me be. <laughs> Are you sleepy yet? <laughs> Still almost. Oh, baby, you're making this hard for me today. <sighs> Mm, no, no, I'm not. I'm not. Not tired. Mm, yeah, I know I stopped talking. <laughs> I don't know what to talk about. So, 
my brain is not working and it's late and I'm tired. <laughs> okay, let me think. Well, so talking about seasons, I don't know why I got this, why I'm talking about this so much today, but whatever, let's just continue with that topic. Um, talking about winter, I do like summer too, because, because it's my birthday in summer, <laughs> no, but also in summer, it's warm, which means no hoodies, which is sad, but, you know, get to eat ice cream a lot. <laughs> yes, I'm, I love food. I love you more, though. Yes. I love you more than food. And that's the biggest compliment I can give a person. <laughs> mm. Well, but you know you get to eat ice cream and you get to go you know to the pool girls in bikinis well not girls in bikinis but you in bikini <laughs> oh babe are you kidding me no sh- sh- shut up shut up you are no you are so damn gorgeous. Yes, with bikini or without bikini, that doesn't matter right now, but... Your body is amazing, babe. You don't think so? Well, you're the only one who doesn't think so. I just know. Just trust me. Well, I think your body is gorgeous. You're such a beautiful woman, like... Mm, damn. <laughs> oh, shut up. I hope you don't really think that that is true. You're not ugly. Nothing about you is ugly. Your your body is beautiful and your inside is beautiful. Seriously, baby, everything about you is beautiful. Like, like Dale, I don't deserve you. No, I'm not sleeping yet. Mm. Oh, I don't have work tomorrow. It's weekend after all. I wanted to, you know, clean up the house a little. And get some stuff down here. I wanted to clean up the bird's cage.
And I wanted to get everything done because, you know, Sunday after laser tag, everybody will come here and Yes, I think we could order pizza. Like, pizza is something everyone likes. And it's also something for vegetarians like me. <laughs> to a store tomorrow like to get some chips and stuff like that maybe popcorn if I want to watch a movie oh and definitely something to drink <laughs> you know everybody's funnier when they're drunk at least a little bit You're still not asleep. Come on, baby. I'm almost asleep and... You're still... So awake. I don't get why. <laughs> no, seriously, I don't. I can't think of any topic to talk about right now. Oh, I just wanted to go to sleep, baby. Maybe I'll stop talking so you don't listen to me anymore and focus on my voice so you can fall asleep easier. I don't know. <laughs> you don't think this is gonna work? <sighs> well, okay. Is that my shirt you're wearing, by the way? <laughs> yeah, I know. I know, I know. Since we're together, there's no... My shirt, your shirt. We're basically sharing every... Everything. Especially clothes. <laughs> no, I like that. Yes, I love your stuff, especially your hoodies and shirts because because you're taller than me and so your stuff is oversized when I wear it and, you know, I love oversized stuff and I especially love your oversized stuff. <laughs> oh, I'm serious, like... Oversized hoodies are so damn comfortable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it feels like I'm just, you know... It feels like a big, big blanket. I don't know how to... I don't know how to say it, but... I love oversized hoodies. sleeping yet. 
I'm really close to sleeping though. What about you? Finally. Baby, before we fall asleep, I just wanted to let you know that I love you so fucking much. Like, I love you more than anything or anyone on this planet. (laughs) And on every other planet in the universe. (laughs) And you are seriously the most amazing person I ever met in my entire life. And I really want you to know how amazing you are because... I know sometimes you can be self-conscious and stuff, but you definitely don't have a reason to be self-conscious because you're perfect in every kind of way. And those who don't see that, they're just blind. Or they're jealous because they want to be like you. But you know, I really hope to spend the rest of my life with you. Because I always want to have you by my side. And I. I just can't imagine life without you. Are you sleeping? Okay, well you're not answering anymore. I think I just heard you snore. Cute. Uh, You're the only person where I even think snoring is cute. But that snore was adorable, seriously. Maybe I will help you with never forgetting that. Because I won't leave you. I won't leave you and I will always be here. Always be there for you. To remind you of how amazing you are. I'm so silly and you know one day one day when I gather up the courage one day when I know exactly what to say
hope you'll say yes. And then, then we can be happy forever. Happily ever after. <laughs> That's what all the Disney movies say. I'll try to sleep.